do you need? Shh. I'm not supposed to talk to anyone. I am Ito. The caretakers are keeping me here. Others too, including my brother. They won't let us leave. What do you mean? Who are these caretakers? Look around you. They're all followers of the monk Zenshin. His speeches have convinced many to serve the Eagle tribe. A monk? Allied with the Mongols? It's madness. The people here believe him. I'm playing along so they don't lock me away. If I can get you out of here, your brother and the others too. Oh, thank you. Just please don't hurt the caretakers. They're good people. Misled by Zenshin's words. All right. I'll act like I want to join them. And see if I can find the other prisoners from inside their ranks. They say the way is through service. Maybe that will help. Zenshin is about to speak, but only to caretakers. Head up this path, and you can listen without being seen. We have to stop talking. They'll see us. Locals following the Eagle tribe. I should see what I'm walking into. These caretakers seem happy and relaxed. Is it all a lie? Mongol supplies. Enough to make this temple the Eagle tribe's new stronghold in the south. Is this the monk Zenshin? At first, the Eagle showed me nightmares. Our people suffering after the samurai invasion. Starving and begging for help I couldn't give. Nightmares. Has he also tasted the eagle's poison? Now, the eagle has shown me a new way. Through serving her tribe, she offers visions of plenty, of peace. Tonight, the eagle tribe comes to put our fears to rest. Prepare the way! Ugh. The Eagle Tribe is coming tonight. I need to feed the captives before they arrive. I should blend in and ask around. Find out where they're holding the prisoners. Peace, friend. I am the warden here. Hello, sisters. May I be of service? Please. With all the food we've gathered, we have more baskets to make than we have fingers. The visions Zanshin described seem darker with each passing day. What will happen to us when the Eagle Tribe comes? Zanshin would not lead us astray. If he says the way is through service, then we serve. Peace, friend. I am the Warden here. I have been serving Zenshin since he saved my family from the samurai. What brings you to our temple? I'm a friend of Ito. She told me of Zenshin's wise words. If you like, I can help guard the prisoners. They are not prisoners, but spirits lost in turmoil. We watch over them until they see the way. But that duty is not for you. And soon it will not be for any of us. The Eagle Tribe is satisfied with our efforts. Tonight, the Mongols will come to reward our good work and occupy this temple. If they take this temple, they could use it to spread the Eagle's word across the entire island. Or beyond. One can only hope. For now, we 
We must hurry to make the final preparations. Walk among us. See if any of our caretakers need a hand or a kind word. Thank you for this opportunity, brother. Why do you struggle? These people want to join me. Soon, you will too. He wasn't very good at that, was he? Hmm. The comely ones never are. I bring a meal for Zenshin. Uh, let me make sure he eats. Leave it. He prepares for the Eagle Tribe. If I leave now, they will suspect me. If Senshin passes? Why would you say such a thing? The Eagle's visions. Who brought you here, friend? I usually assign caretakers. Better not linger. This one still lives in turmoil. The warden told me to lend a helping hand. I've come to protect Zenshin's way. Then you are welcome here, brother. Zenshin's way will guide us to peace and prosperity. I know this. But not everyone believes as we do. I heard you bring people here to help them find a way. The poor souls in turmoil, yes. Where are you keeping them? Safely away from the caretakers. Eventually, whether peasant girl or blustering warrior, they all want to join us. Continue your service, brother. No entry. I understand. I only wish to be of service. I'm to prepare food for the ones in turmoil. Hmm. Not all are allowed in. Or out. This building has a story to tell. She cannot speak. She has not yet overcome her turmoil. Oh dear. When the door opens, we run. Pass the guard? Don't be foolish. There's only one way out. Accepting the truth of the way. Captives. Can't free them now without bloodshed. I should return when fewer eyes are watching. I've learned what I can. I'll wait for the right moment to free the captives. Look at you. Peace, friends. Mind if I rest here for a moment? Join us. But if you are looking for a drink, you'll need to find your own sake. It's a wonder more don't come here willingly. Once the eagle arrives, my family will no longer worry how I'll fill my belly. Or my cup. We service the only price.
need to act now, while they're still sleeping. They are already free. You are the one trapped by your fear. come to save you it's a test they want to see if we know the way no no test I'm here to free everyone held here against their will have you seen a woman named Ito no no one by that name hmm. she must be in another building the Ito tribe is here Keepers. Stay here until I take care of the guards. Then you can escape. Be all right. You came. But what about my brother? I'll tell him you're waiting by the stairs. Go there when it's safe, and you can return home together. And the rest? They're fools, but they don't all deserve the Eagle Tribe's cruelty. I will stop the Mongols, and I will speak with Zenshin to make sure this never happens again. Please show him kindness. He's a good man. Oh, he was. Until the eagle came. Before another Mongol spots you. I have to stay. I snuck out to find my sister. Ito? Yes. How did you know? I've already freed her. Go. She's waiting for you by the stairs. Oh, better than I could have hoped. Thank you.
Entlegge um Bett. Now for Zenshin. He must be in the temple. Not the eagle. You're safe. She's not here. But she did give me this... poison, too. I can still hear her inside my head, building up my fears to make me feel small. But I won't allow it. And neither will you. Tell me what you see. Child crying. His home burned by samurai. Begging me for food I do not have. I tried to stop it. I tried. I can't bear this alone. You won't have to. Not tonight. Her voice is still there, but fainter. The things I did, the promises I told my followers. What have I done? What the Eagle wanted. Now you can tell your people the truth. How the Eagle tribe twists our minds with fear and lies to make us their willing servants. If I can undo it, I will. Then I will leave the temple behind. Until I can no longer hear her voice. I hope you find peace soon, Zenshin. Thank you. I hope whatever truth haunts you, you won't face it alone. are talking. Can you hear that? Yeah. 
Jin from Yarikawa. Didn't think you'd make it. What happened here? Friends of mine lived on this farm. I hoped they'd join our fight. But those Mongol bastards got to them first. The least they deserve is a proper burial. Won't be long. I'll help you. You don't have to do that. I know. I want to. Hm. Grab the spade. May they find peace in the next life. I didn't take you for a religious man. I'm full of surprises. You said you would think about bringing me to your crew. Have you made up your mind? That depends. Is the eagle's poison still affecting you? Yes, but it hasn't slowed me down. Take me to meet your raider friends, and I'll prove I can help you fight back. <sighs> All right, samurai. We've got a ride ahead of us. Try and keep up. Where are you taking me? An old raider stronghold. We used it to hide from the samurai. Now it's keeping us safe from the Mongols. You're not worried about taking a samurai to your secret hideaway? Of course I am. But we need every fighting arm we can get. Just watch yourself once we get there. Ever since the Sakai invasion, samurai are slightly less popular than a pit of venomous snakes. The Sakai invasion? The butcher of Iki and his gang thought they could bring a little law and order to our island. <laughs> we showed them. Not before losing a lot of good people. From what I heard, neither side was innocent. There's some truth to that. I've never seen a pretty war. There's a hidden entrance to the stronghold up ahead. Mongols, we found the entrance. Let's see how we will face me first. Tonight. Getting in this way. That's Fune's doing. Any outsiders find our home, we block the entrance and kill the witnesses. No exceptions. I hope she's more welcoming to invited guests. We'll find out soon enough. Is there another way in? Only by sea. There was a path years ago, before my time. Don't know if it's still there. It's worth a shot. How many samurai? This man murdered. Remember your father's attendant? His throat was opened while he slept. His blood sprayed your tent. Silence! Zin, you all right? Yes. Sometimes I hear the eagle's voice. Like she can read your mind or something? No. I hear my own thoughts. Things I didn't know I was thinking. But in her voice... I hope it wears off. I see why the samurai never found this hideaway of yours. It's the only stronghold on Iki that survived the Sakai invasion. Let's hope that holds for the Mongols. No way to cross. There's always a way. Samurai have to say shit like that. Do pirates have to mouth off? Just the clever ones. Neat trick. I could use one of those. It was a gift from a brilliant friend. He passed. I'm sorry to hear that. Minor setback. Look for a way around. Seen a 
samurai do that before. You're welcome to join me. You all right? I'm fine. You're doing great. Don't die. One of our ships. Friends of yours? Would you call them friends? Yes, I knew them. That makes four craft we've lost to the Eagle's warship. I'll get us through here. How did you join up with Hune? We enjoyed the hospitality of the Sakai Inn together. You mean Fort Sakai? Terrible food. But we left with our heads intact. Most of the guests weren't so lucky. Almost there. He is luring you into a den of murderers. They will kill you just as they killed your father. <sighs> when we step through that gate, there's no turning back. Everything you do is on my head. Don't make me regret this, Samurai. You don't have to worry about me, Tenzo. I promise. Good. Keep that attitude and you'll be fine. Just stay close. Keep your sword sheathed and let me do the talking. Here we go. Tenzo? You're back. You brought a samurai here? Wait until Hune hears about this. I'll tell her myself. Get back to your posts. I'm watching you, Samurai. Let's get you to Hune. Impress her, and the wolves will back off. And if I don't impress her? I've seen her tie men up and leave them to drown at high tide. Even hung one traitor from the mast of her ship for the gulls to eat. But I don't know what she'll do to a Samurai. And those people... More victims of the eagle's poison. Not as lucky as you. Tenzo! You're running out of clean rags! Check the drawers. I have a shirt you can strip down. Let's go, Jin. Finney's waiting. Was that your house? They needed more than me. There's Fune, watching us from her favorite pouch. Tenzo! Get your ass up here! Coming, Fune! Remember, make nice. And stole the samurai attitude. Welcome back, Tenzo. I can explain. I hope so. Because right now, I'm really curious why you brought a samurai into my home. You sent me to find people who can fight. Fight for us, not against us. If I wanted to come for you, you would know it. Jin. It's all right, Tenzo. I want to hear this samurai dig his own grave. I'm here because the Mongols invaded my home, too. And if the Eagle isn't stopped on your shores, she's going to bring her army and her poison to Tsushima. We can defeat the Eagle and save both our homes, but only if we work together. He's your catch, Tenzo. What's your take? Maybe he helps us. Or he's skewered on a Mongol spear. And you get to brag about one more samurai dying on Iki Island. Either way, we've got nothing to lose. You're in, Samurai. I hope you don't get seasick. When the next storm hits, we're taking every boat in this cove and attacking that Mongol warship. Sounds like a good way to lose half your men. Get me aboard that warship, and I can sink it. 
Tenzo. Get this fool out of my face. Jin may have a point. We can't get close enough to board the warship, but a Mongol boat from Iki resupplies them every few days. We can take their supply ship and make the delivery ourselves. Tenzo, if you think this can work, you're in charge. I need a dozen men. Jin can be one of them. They're yours. The supply ship docks on the northeast side of the island. Look for a small inlet, steep cliffs. I'll meet you there. Fune, it has been a pleasure. Just watch your step, Samurai. What the cruelty of black hand Careful, Matt. What are you talking about? Black hand Riku, the cursed pirate captain who terrorizes Iki Island from beyond the grave. Hmm. Black hand Riku. Didn't he die at sea years ago? That he did. I am Kashira. I sailed on Riku's bloodstained banner. The things I saw still haunt my nightmares. Perhaps you can tell me the tale. Of course. I hope you have a strong stomach. Black Hand Riku was once the cruelest pirate captain to ever terrorize Iki Island. He carved up his victims, piece by piece, always saving a morsel for his loyal companion, a vicious monk. Riku built his armor to honor a brutal Sarugami. This monkey demon inhabited his armor. Its cursed whispers drove Riku to take risks, tempting him with the spoils of battle while pushing him to the brink of ruin. Six years ago, Black Hand Riku attacked a refugee ship. Its cargo, children. He threw the young ones overboard. Their samurai protector, he skinned alive. His crew watched in horror while Riku's monkey fed on the trimmings. Then, Mutiny. Black Hand Riku's crew plotted to poison their wretched leader. He was stabbed through the chest and blinded by the poison. But he clung to life, protected by the armor of the Sarugami. Riku set his ship ablaze and fled with his monkey, while his crew burned to death in their fiery tomb. Before he died, Riku hid his Sarugami armor somewhere on Iki Island. Now he haunts the coast. A wrathful spirit who preys on anyone brave or foolish enough to seek the cursed armor of Black Hand Riku. So you sailed with Black Henriku and plotted his death. Someone had to stop him. And no one has found his Sarugami armor? Many have tried, but they all fell victim to his wrathful spirit. People say the monkeys of Iki are his eyes and ears. If that's the case, he already knows I'm interested. Where did your ship go down? 
I don't remember much of that night, but one other crew member survived. Minato. She spends her time hiking Mount Take no Tsuchi, trying to forget the horrors we lived through. Thank you for the tale. Be careful. The monkeys are watching. Black Hand Riku sees everything. I won't kneel, and I won't drink your damn poison, whatever it is. Chiharu! Of guest saved by a samurai. Are you Minato? Who's asking? A ronin looking for some long lost armor. I hear you used to sail on the Black Hand Riku. Shh, quiet. You hear you. So you believe the stories? Some nights I feel Riku watching me. I can hear his pet monkey sucking marrow from bones. I know it sounds crazy, but. I swear, those filthy monkeys are watching us. Do you remember anything about the Night of the Mutiny? Anything that could help me find this final resting place? <sighs> we were anchored just off the northeastern shore. There was something under the water, something glowing. The moon's reflection? Moon wasn't out that night. Glowing water. It's not much, but it will have to do. yourself a favor. Forget the armor.
Buster, das ist er. Light beneath the water. Hmm. Riku was blinded. Maybe he saw just enough to follow the light before his pet monkey did. Did you come here, Riku? A passage. Locked. If I light the brazier, maybe I'll find a way through. Monkeys. What are they playing with? Hmm. Maybe those flaming arrows. Fire might help. I start a fire. Maybe there's flaming arrows.
Listen. Someone left writing here. Someone's hoard. Must have taken years to collect. <laughs> I have seen you in my dreams. Show yourself. <laughs> Another hunter, desperate for my armor and the power of the Sarugami. Black Hand Riku, you survived. No, I was reborn in darkness. You're blind. This isn't a fair fight. No, it is not. Never 
see the sun. Time to get out of here. 